guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is very exciting because I'm taking Dan out for his first show in like over two years. And my first show in like quite a long time too, like over two months I think it is now. For those of you who don't know, I brought Dan out of retirement a couple of months ago maybe. Um, we're doing our first elementary today, just at our local show. But I'm very excited, so I'm a bit behind on schedule, so I need to get going. Um, he needs to have a slight wash, not a lot, just his tail and his legs. And then I need to plait him, and I forgot how long it takes me to plait. Like, his mane is insane. So I'm going to get started, and I think I'll see you guys after I've washed him. <laughs> not much vlogging of the preparation today, because I'm so behind, sorry. Before and after. There we go. Looking very handsome and quite clean. Okay, so now we're doing the main, so before, and there we go. So, <laughs> they're definitely plats. Um, can't say they're, well, you know, before you, judge, before you judge me, I invite you to have a go yourself because, hmm, his mane is interesting. Oh God, don't look at the plats. No, stop making fun of my plats. You look very handsome though, I, pop, I don't really know what's going on like all around. You know, I don't really know what's going on full stop with it, but uh, certainly interesting. But he's very happy, he's got a little massage rug on at the moment, having a bit of a massage. Yes, Danny? <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to let him dry off and then we can head off. Okay, we're all ready to go. I finished getting Dan ready. Mum plaited his tail, which is actually very good, I'm very impressed with the tail. You sound surprised. I am surprised. <laughs> no, I'm kidding though, it's actually really nice, look at that. It was always been pulled, so yeah, but we let it grow out because we didn't think he'd really be competing again. But here we are, um, Daniel. He's just scavenging for food at the moment. He acts like we starve him. I promise we don't. There we go. <laughs> he looks very handsome, and he's very happy to be out competing. Yay! Okay, right. Let's get you in. Here he is in his Dotson Hall rug, looking very handsome indeed. Um, okay, a bit of Bella love for good luck from Bella. Oh, right, maybe not. Okay. Dan is in, ready to go. <laughs> you excited, Dan? Are you shaking your leg? Okay, right. Let's get going. See you later, Dan. So on the road now, um, it's literally like 10 minutes away, I think. Um, so I just want to talk a little bit about why I'm doing an elementary, because I'm sure some of you are confused, considering Dan hasn't been out with me competing in like over two years. So he, Usually we're at like prelim, maybe a couple of novices, but we're training at quite a higher level at home now, mainly because over the last couple of years I've learned how to ride properly and that's kind of meant when I got back with Dan, I spoke about it a bit in my um, bringing back Dan into work, if you want to check that out, I'll link it here. Um, but I can suddenly ride him much better, so it means he can do all the moves like properly now, which we were trying to do a couple of years ago, but I never just really knew how to do. So we just thought we'd go out, have a bit of fun, it's completely unaffiliated, it's literally like a local show, so there's no pressure or anything, and just, you know, have some fun at an elementary. I've always wanted to do an elementary with him, but never really knew how to do the moves properly, so now we can, we thought it'd be fun to give it a go, so that's kind of it. But yeah, uh, literally like five minutes away now, so I'll see you guys when we get there. Okay guys, as per usual, I'm a little bit behind schedule, so I'm going to have to shake a leg, um, and not vlog me getting on Dan. So I will see you guys after my test. We're only doing the one test, so I'll see you guys after. Wish us luck. Okay, I know I said I'll see you after my test, but I just want to do a last check-in in my competition gear because I haven't in, like, it feels like forever. Look, I feel so smart. It's been so long. Ah. Uh, anyway, um, also check out my new boots from Ariat. They're really smart and shiny. I really like these. They're the Heritage Contour, in case you're interested. Um, and obviously my champion hat. Actually, it's my favourite hat from them, I think, because it's just so comfy on my head. Just go check on Dan. Dan, Dan, he's over there. Okay, right. I'll see you guys after. I actually will now. Bye.
Oh my goodness. Little Daniel, he can still strut his stuff. He just did the loveliest little test you saw in the video. He is so cool and he was so happy to be out. And everyone at the end was like, oh my God, what a pleasure to watch. That was, what a performance. <laughs> Dan getting the praise he deserves from everyone. So that was really nice. And I can believe he was 20. I can't believe he's 20. I'm so proud of him. He had a great time out. <laughs> Oh, I missed you so much. Right, I'm gonna put him away now. Hello, mister. Hello, with your frizzy mane. <laughs> anyway, Dan, what's this? Dan, what's this? A first place, Rosa? For Dan, a first place? <laughs> He's like, it was out of one. <laughs> yes, it was only out of one, Dan, but that doesn't take away from the fact you got 73.8% in your first ever elementary. Oh, very handsome. <laughs> Good boy, let's go home. So we're heading home now. I'm so proud of Dan. Look at his little sheet. Look at that, he got a nine for his six second hole and a nine for his change rain with change of leg over X. Like the canter trot, canter to transition. He is just, I love that little pony. I'm never gonna find another like him. He just is so brilliant. I mean, he did win it, but he won out of one, so it's not that impressive, but the 73.8% is pretty impressive. I mean, it was probably quite nicely marked, but for his first elementary, that's amazing. <laughs> oh, I'm so proud of him. That's exactly what I needed after being stuck inside for two weeks with coronavirus, but I'm def- By the way, guys, I have finished my two-week quarantine now, so I definitely am COVID-free, so I'm allowed out of the house. So is my mum. Uh, just, just so you all know. But anyway, I'm gonna get home now, put him out. Um, he can go in the field for a bit and chill out. And he's very happy, as he should be. Oh, I've had such a good day. I miss doing now. I miss Danny days. <gasps> what a superstar. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Daniel. You want a carrot? You want a carrot? Yeah. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's get you out. Look at that forelock. About to put the superstar out. Hey, buddy. <laughs> I really like your mane and your forelock, Dan, by the way. I think it's really cute. Look at that. Oh my god, it's yellow. That's all the grease that was holding it in place. <laughs> oh. Oh, Dan, Dan. <laughs> okay, let's put you out, buddy. So I've just put Dan out. So that's the end of this video. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing Dan back out and about in his element. He is very happy. I'm very happy. It's been a very good day. Hopefully, I'm going to do some more dressage on him. Maybe some riding club, maybe some BD. Um, see what see where it leads us he's definitely proved to me that he is so not ready to retire yet like he has so much left in him and he loves it too and he's good at it as well so i think I'm gonna make the most of that and get out as much as we can over winter oh i love him also just while i'm here i want to say a massive thank you to albion for lending me a saddle to ride dan in because beforehand he was literally in like a really old wintech um didn't really fit him, didn't fit me, but they really kind of let me a GP, which means he's so much more comfortable, he goes so much better in it, and I'm so much more comfortable. And that's really like allowed us to bring him back into work properly and get him out competing. So massive thank you to Albion for doing that, it's so appreciated. Big thank you to Dodson Hurrell for making him look so lovely and keeping him in such great condition. Oh, he's rolling right now. He doesn't look too good at the moment when he's rolling. But I just want to say that they have been amazing for him and he is looking so good at 20. And he has, you might know that he's got Cushing, so like for him to look in such great condition it's all credit to their feed so big thanks to them and yeah that's that's it i guess so thanks for watching and don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe for more and i'll see you very soon bye